Simon Coombs, uh, President and uh, CEO of Chazar Hotels. Good afternoon and thank you for joining Breaking Travel News today. We're here at the Arabian Travel Market uh, 2015. Just tell us how the show is going for you so far this year. Well, it's going very well. It's, uh, it's, uh, it's always very exciting to see all of the brands here together. It's uh, interesting to compare yourself and also it's a very small industry so we catch up with a lot of uh, uh, old colleagues and, and young colleagues uh, but very nice to reconnect. Uh, with everybody in the in, uh, very diverse industry. Uh, we're here in Dubai for, yes, for the event, uh, one of the most dynamic, exciting mm -hmm. uh, tourism markets anywhere in the world. Yes. I believe you have 10, uh, 10 properties coming on stream across the Middle East. Perhaps you could just bring us up to date with uh, what's happening with those. We do. Um, I mean, in the last uh, two years, we've uh, accelerated our portfolio. We intend to be uh, 14 hotels uh, signed and under development by the end of this year. Mm -hmm. The ones that have already been secured across the region, and they include uh, Amman, they include uh, Mecca, Riyadh, Jeddah, Doha, Salalah, uh, fantastic resort developments, we, you'll see images here, we've completed the design, something very exciting, uh, very important to Amman, uh, you know a lot of the, uh, the, the governments now are diversifying within the Middle East, uh, moving away from uh, oil and gas, realizing the great opportunity uh, that tourism brings, the great multiplier effect it has on their economies, uh, countries such as Oman uh, have been uh, very successful in that and of course Dubai has everything here in a very dynamic market. Uh, despite the economic cycles it still continues to grow uh, from strength to strength. Um, I was going to say how would you characterize the market here at the moment? We've been hearing a lot of Russian visitors perhaps aren't visiting this year but they've been replaced by other, other nationalities. Is that something you've experienced? Yes, I think, I think there's, there is volatility in the market. There, there has been a a slight softening in, in occupancies uh, over time. With a lot of supply coming into the market, it's inevitable as a market dynamic. Uh, but as long as the fundamentals in the economies remain strong uh, and stabilization within the region, uh, although it tends to work a little bit differently uh, for Dubai because the, the instability in some areas has actually created uh, increased demand uh, as people have come into uh, Dubai as a, as a safe haven. Uh, so, so I think uh, it will take uh, continued recovery. I think the market has been very strong, uh, but I don't think Dubai will, uh, will ever reach uh, very low levels, but there will be a market adjustment, which is natural uh, as part of the supply and demand equation. And just finally, something I believe you're an expert on a little bit about uh, halal tourism. Is that an important area here in the Middle East? Well, it, it's difficult to say an expert, but, uh, but certainly it's something that characterizes our brand. Uh, we believe that we're unique in, in being the only uh, luxury uh, hotel operator. There are many uh, independent halal uh, uh, hotels, but we're the only uh, chain uh, independent operator that is not just a halal uh, in individual properties, but across our whole brand, regardless of where we're developing. And as I say, I, I believe we occupy a unique position in that market. Um, there is a huge growing uh, uh, demographic, economic demographic, uh, if you call it an Islamic Muslim demographic, uh, demographic uh, people who uh, appreciate luxury uh, but also appreciate being able to express their own lifestyles in a way that they're used to and we offer them uh, that opportunity to do that in a contemporary luxury setting that celebrates their values and the cultures. That's very interesting to hear. Thank you very much for your time, Sarah. I'll let you get back to the show. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Thank you.